Ooh, welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Mega Man X. This is the last episode. Um, in this episode we're going to take on Sigma's Fortress number 4, which is not an, an, a true level, it's just <clears throat> a bunch of boss fights. We're going to take on Velgarder, <clears throat> who is Sigma's wolf companion. Then we're going to take on Sigma himself. Or itself, himself, him. Yeah. Um, just so you know, I am gonna try to employ the um, Hadouken. I'm gonna try it. I don't know if it's gonna work, but uh, that's the plan, at least. So practice it. Uh, let's do it. So this is just a vertical shaft. You're gonna have to wall jump all the way up. If you so happen to need to refill your sub tanks, this is not a great place to do it, but you can because there will be enemies that come out of these pipes. So if you can just kill them, they'll drop health. But be careful not to uh, get hit by them because they will drop. All right, I'm actually not gonna do that. I'm just showing you that you can. Um, <clears throat> and we're just going to move on. Alright, so the first mini-boss is susceptible to ice. So have your ice ready. Um, as soon as you step on the flat surface up there, the boss fight will start. Um, so get ready for some Hadouken, and if you can't get them Hadouken, get ready for your shotgun ice. Alright, so, um, alright, let's do it. Welcome, I see you managed to get here by yourself. Very impressive. Yeah, typical bad guy small talk, right? Mm, I could destroy you, but I would not rob my pet of that pleasure. Ma, 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 ma. He knows how to deal with betrayers. Should you live, I will be waiting for you. Don't disappoint me, X. Wa, ha, ha, ha. Oh, he didn't kill him. How? That's... What? Okay. Did not expect to not kill him. I'll be honest with you. Oh, for goodness sake. Okay. Um, equip your electric spark for the actual Sigma battle. Um, <clears throat> Sigma is himself is not that hard. He's actually really easy. Uh, just look at his timing, the way he times his jumps, and you could probably do it without getting hit at all. Um, I can't believe Vilgar didn't die with that Hadouken. Whatever. Excellent job, X. I see you why zero counted in you. You're almost as good a hunter as I was. But the time of your destruction has arrived. You shall regret ever having to fight me. He takes off his cape, and he gets a lightsaber. So this is what he's gonna do. Oh, don't get don't get touched. He hits hard. This is basically all you have to do. This is all he does. If you if you're patient, you won't get touched at all during this fight. Which is good because the next part, I'm sorry, I'm just going to go ahead and tell you. 
it's a two-part boss battle, or a three-part one if you count Bell Carter, but the next part is incredibly difficult. And you're gonna want all your uh, sub tanks full. Dang it. I, I threw off the timing, now I'm screwed. Yeah, I threw it out. Now I have to re-memorize the pattern. But he's almost dead, so... Okay. He is susceptible, and only susceptible, to rolling shield. This is just... the most difficult. The most difficult fight in the game by far okay I don't even know how to explain this you have to jump on his claws um, only his head is vulnerable and his claws are the only way you can reach his head so wait for his claws to come down at you because he's gonna try to attack you with his claws jump on the claws use them as platforms but be careful because you can get hit even on the claws, you're going to get walloped, and he packs an incredible punch. There will be fire and electricity and lasers shooting everywhere. So you just avoid it as best you can. Use your sub-tanks wisely. <sighs> All right, here we go. Dang it. Oh my god, I can't believe he killed me like that. Unbelievable. He really did. Like I said, he packs a wallop. Incredibly, he hits incredibly hard. I didn't think that was going to kill me in one shot. I was going to wait to get hit one more time and then use a sub tank. Well, anyway, I'll catch you guys when I uh, get back to him. Because I'm not going to show you this again. If you stand on the edge, you may not get hit. This is, I guess this is the best trick I can, I can tell you. Just stand right here, try not to get hit. Easier said than done, mind you. Oh, come on, how did I fall? No way. Ugh. How? How? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. Be patient. No way! That's some crap. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know they could do that. Oh. <laughs> I didn't see my health. And he's not even close to death, huh? Oh, you can't clip through them either. Dang it. Oh, man. I'm in some deep trouble here. Transfer over. Good grief, man. I thought I was being clever just standing here. But he's close. Just don't fall off! Okay. <clears throat> I don't think I can take another shot. Ugh, come on, man. Can a claw come down, please? Thank you. He's almost gone. He's almost gone, but so am I. So, I think I need another health. Maybe I didn't. 
Maybe that was a mistake. I don't know. Got him. Man. No, it's not possible. I'm a Reploid. I can't be destroyed by you. Why, X, why have you done this to us? Without the humans, my Reploid brothers could have ushered in a new age. Uh, Sigma's fortress is destroyed. We got out safely, of course. Of course we got out safely. The war has ended, for now, and peace has been restored. But those who sacrifice themselves for the victory will never return. Exhausted, X gazes at the destruction he helped cause and wonders why he chose to fight. Was there another way? Probably not. I don't think he was given a choice. I mean, it's either fight or watch the entire world be destroyed. Standing on the cliff, the answers seem to escape him. He only knows that he'll fight the Mavericks again before he finds his answer. How long will he keep on fighting? How long will his pain last? <laughs> Maybe, <laughs> this is so corny. Maybe only the X-Buster on his hand knows for sure. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just the cheesiest line I've ever read. Yeah, well, um, that's it for Mega Man X. Of course, Mega Man X became a series onto itself. Uh, there's Mega Man X1, I mean X2, X3, etc. Um, I haven't played any of the other Xs. This is the only X I've ever played. There's also Maverick Hunter, which is like a spin-off, I guess. Um, oh, and it tells you all the enemies that you, uh, that you encounter. Pretty cool. Like a cast of characters, I guess you could say. T55J, that's that big, big rope that we fought with the claws and stuff. Eh. Pretty cool. I I really like this game. I hope you guys had fun watching. And I see all another cast of characters here. Chill Penguin, Launch Octopus. Um, but yeah, I have, I've never played any, any of the other X games. Um, but I hope this, uh, this is a good series for you. This is a little short one, but I think this game is a lot of fun. And um, I, I really enjoy playing it. I've played it I don't know how many times like more than a dozen um, I, I love the Mega Man formula you fight bosses you take their powers and then you use those powers against other enemies I think it's such a cool mechanic and the first time you play it of course you try you gotta experiment which which uh, attack does what to what enemies and um, I, I really just I really think it's a very cool formula um, and I think this is this is my favorite Mega Man game. It's not too hard. It's just hard enough. It's still cheap in its own special way, but it's not Mega Man 2, Mega Man 1 cheap, you know. And you, as Mega Man X. So, um, I think that's, uh, well, that's going to be it for this series. Um... I'm going to finish watching the, the credits here because there's more at the end. Um, as per usual, back in the olden days, 
uh, people, companies did not use their their designers and, and staff real name for uh, fear that other companies would come and steal their programmers away. So, so that sound designer, his name is not Elf. I can guarantee you that. Dr. Kuhn? Yeah, no. So, Professor F was not the producer of this game. So, anyway, I think that's Honolulu Yama. I like watching these. White Rock. Anyway, what was I going to say? Yeah, anyway, that's it for this series, but there is a little something at the end. Here. Thanks for playing. Presented by Capcom. And my controller turned off. So that's why the screen went dark. If you wait long enough, you'll see Sigma's face and say it's the end or something like that. So we'll just leave it on for a little bit. Um, but yeah, uh, like I said, I hope you really enjoyed this game. This is my favorite Mega Man. Um, maybe I'll do Mega Man 1, 2, 3, 4 someday. But those games are just ridiculously hard and I'm not very good at them. Um, but I guess as far as what's next, wait, what's this? This is what I wanted to show. You have won a temporary victory, X. What you destroyed was only a temporary body. My spirit remains intact. Ah. In time, I will find other bodies strong enough to do my bidding, and I will return. I shall see you soon, X. Very soon. And there you go. Uh, Sigma will be back. We have not defeated Sigma for good. As per usual, you know. There has to be a sequel. You know, Dr. Wily, you defeated him so many times, and he always begged for forgiveness. Right? He always just begged for forgiveness. And Mega Man being the robot that he is, he can't harm humans. That's rule of robotics number one. So he let him live. And that's why we had Mega Man 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, etc. If he had just killed Dr. Wily, you know, the series would have been over, but at least humanity would have been safe. So, I don't know what to say. But uh, as far as Mega Man, I don't, I don't know. Maybe we'll see. I don't know. It depends. Uh, as far as for what's next, uh, I haven't really decided. So, I don't know. We'll find out. So, anyway, that's it for Mega Man X. I hope you guys enjoyed. And, uh, yeah, catch you guys in whatever I work on next. See you then.